Hey guys, welcome back to another quick form video. In today's video, we're talking about a really good promotion, probably the cheapest that Boost Mobile has offered yet for an unlimited plan. It's really cool. So this is by Fierce Wireless. Of course, other outlets are reported on it, and of course, uh, you know, really good platform. Yes, this is uh, true news about this. So just confirmed it, and yes, guys. So it says Boost launches no BS plan for twenty five dollars a month. You can also check on their press release. I'll I'll check that out. Um, so it says, uh, while big carriers are increasing the cost of the wireless service plans, Boost Mobile says it's going to do the opposite, or it's going the opposite direction, guys. So, really cool, like I said, uh, really nice uh, information, guys. Uh, sorry if you hear the fan, it's super hot right here in uh, in the south, so we got we got to have the fan blowing. Um, but let's get into it, like I said, it's, uh, offering a $25 a month plan without any gotchas attached to it. Wow, so... They're saying, Boost Mobile is saying that they will offer you unlimited data, talk, text, and all that good stuff for $25 a month. There's no strings attached or anything like that or hidden fees or anything like that. Wow, that's, that's pretty crazy because that's a really good deal, guys. It says, Boost, so, Boost said that it's, uh, it is most direct shot yet to the big three carrier prices. So, you know, they're, they're trying to, you know, be like, yo, T-Mobile, AT&T, and Verizon, you know, you guys suck. We out here, this is Boost Mobile, you know, $25 a month, you get a limited talk text and data. So it says it's not a promotional offer and it's not contingent on a family plan commitment. The company promised it will stay at $25 for a life. Wow, that's a big, big... Yeah, <laughs> and I know a little bit about this, guys. Uh, uh, probably another video, that's another video. But uh, yes, guys, so... $25 a month for life. This is not, uh, basically, they're not saying it's going to go away anytime. This is going to be uh, just a price that they have for life, of course. I'm wondering how much data. They say limited data, but maybe there is, uh, you know, a certain amount of data that they will only offer. This is a uh, Harito, so there's no liquor or anything. This is just soda. Uh, good soda. So, basically, it says, you know, You'll be able to get this promotion for life. Now, of course, there's a little bit of a caveat. So here it is. It says customers need to be on auto pay. Otherwise, Boo says it's removing all the standard gimmicks that most people encounter when shopping for a cell phone plan. Uh, the, that means the plan, which is part of its carrier crusher program, comes with no three month prepaid requirements, no family plan commitments, no BS. Really cool. So most of the times, guys, I don't know if you know, but you know, AT&T and uh, you know, definitely ATT has been one of those carriers that you're gonna watch when they're like offering twenty five dollars a month for your month service, but you have to buy a bundle, so you have to buy you know three months worth of service or something like that, or you need to have a family of four or something like that. And a lot of carriers do do the family plan commitment, especially postpaid, where they're like you can get your monthly plan as low as thirty dollars a month, but that requires four people in your family. Uh, now, of course, they don't have to be in your family. You can just have friends and family, but still, you're going to have four people, and then you're going to rely that they're going to be paying the monthly bill. So, you know, with this, is $25. You can you just have to leave the auto pay on. If you take it off, well, yeah. It says, uh, there's not a wireless option on the market as competitive as Boost Mobile's 25 Forever plan. We know uh, consumers have been overpaying for unlimited access, such as $80 a month with other guys. That's big Verizon and AT&T and probably T-Mobile too. Uh, so, that says, Boost said it's $25 per month unlimited plan. It's less than 50% of what consumers pay for the same 5G networks on other carriers, adding that switching to Boost Mobile can save new customers as much as $400 a year or $1,200 for a family of four. Wow. Pretty cool. The latest move is... It's a bring your own device offer. So this latest move is so basically it's gonna say bring your own device. It looks like it's gonna be a uh, BYOD or bring your own device offer. So you have to have uh, you know a phone with someone else and bring it over Boost Mobile. So what it's saying, you know, we'll find out when it launches tomorrow because this officially launches tomorrow. We'll see more about this. Of course, these are just reports. It says it is an aggressive offer from Boost and likely represents an effort to address its negative subscriber performance. I don't know if you guys know, since the merger, man, Boost Mobile's been, you know, leaking customers. And by that, I mean bleeding customers, you know. It's been losing lots of customers. I remember these that have, like, I think, like, 9.2, 9.3 million customers. They're down to 8.2 million, which is still a lot of people, guys. Don't get me wrong. But, you know, first quarter, they lost 340, 
3,000 subscribers, which is kind of bad. But, uh, you know, they're trying to do something with this plan to get more people to switch over, which is great. Um, I think with $25 a month is such a steal for limited data, guys, that, you know, anybody's going to, everybody that can, can come go ahead and get this plan. Something competing with consumer cellular, especially, you know, for the older generation of people, they, you know, they usually get offered 25 a dollars a month plan so this will definitely be something that's aggressive and will attract a lot of people so basically if you switch over you know from uh you know let's say verizon you have an iphone you use it on boost mobile you can get 25 dollars a month for limited talk text and data remember the unlimited plan is 35 gigs of data which is what uh verizon or i mean what boost mobile thinks is uh true limited they're saying that not many people need that much so says in November, Boost introduced uh, its first carrier crusher plan, which consists of 12 months of unlimited talking text plus one gig of high speed data for $100 per year or $8.33 a month, which for one gig, guys, I would not get that. Trust me. Uh, says Dish Network acquired Boost Mode for $1.4 billion in 2020. And so it's been two years. Uh, so it says as part of the government's remedy in the T Mobile slash spring com uh, combination setting up dish as a fourth uh, facilities based service provider so wow so we're still waiting on a dish but they're saying they're supposed to be coming out pretty aggressive you know they've teamed up with AT&T that's why with this carrier crusher it's under AT&T instead of T-Mobile's network so pretty cool guys let me know in the comments below what you think is this something that you're interested in would you switch over to boost mobile would this make you switch over to boost mobile so I think I would have to test that out and see what the whole deal is about. So thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe. A lot more videos coming your way. Trigonic Warfare sign off. Might make a video tomorrow. Just checking out what the full details are on this plan. So check it out, guys. Thank you. And Trigonic Warfare signing off. Kind of tired. Been a long day. But, you know. But it is what it is. Um, I'll be trying to make a lot more videos uh, pretty soon talking about, uh, you know, from reviews, there just hasn't been any phones that are coming out. But like I said, uh, but getting back to this plan, like I said, it's twenty five dollars a month, guys. That's that's definitely cheap for one line with auto pay. All you have to do is keep the auto pay. I mean, who's not going to do that? You know. Um, overall, I think it's definitely good. And like I said, the company's definitely been bleeding customers, so this is a good time for them to try to recoup all them customers. And especially if it's using AT and T's network, which is a better network. Then oh, let's say T-Mobile, that, that definitely will, will help the outcome. I think overall, if the company keeps doing these great promotions, it will be a solid competitor. And like I said, Dish Network is doing a lot to get their 5G network. It's not going to be available everywhere uh, once it does launch. But like I said, they are trying. So that's all that matters. So thank you for watching, guys. And I uh, thought I'd just give you my two cents on that. So thank you.